Greetings, Raven. Thank you for accepting this commission, and welcome to Kuomar. For the past 20 years, it has been controlled by two people, President Omar al-Bakr and his wife, Bibi Rashida. Their regime is both cruel and brutal, but we saw no reason to interfere. Till now. We have actionable intel Kuomar is planning an offensive against a neighboring state. A war here is unacceptable. It will disrupt the whole region, inflating global oil prices. The conflict was triggered by the assassination of President al-Bakr. His wife has taken power, but her grip is weak. Some within her government resent both her gender and Western education. However, she's supported by a close network of warlords. They provide troops and weaponry to Rashida, reinforcing her control and preventing open revolt. The regime is financed by the hacker and crypto anarchist, Lars Hellström. Wanted by multiple agencies, he threatens governments, rigs elections, and holds corporations to ransom. Together, they are the masterminds behind this offensive. We need you to shut them all down. We also have a friendly in country, Taj Tahir, a journalist and the son of one of Rashida's few political opponents. He disappeared after being arrested on espionage charges. Find him. Kumar's terrain is both arid and mountainous, so getting close to a target may not be possible. We know you're a long shot specialist, so this shouldn't be a problem. Your new gear should help, especially the prototype visor. It has an enhanced battlefield display and a direct comms link to me. Rashida and her allies cannot be allowed to ignite the region. Her war must be stopped. I'll be in touch. How's the heat there, Raven? It's time to get familiar with your weapons and gear. The tactical visor we supplied provides a live feed from your scope. It's equipped with an advanced combat display. You'll be able to scan terrain as well as tag and track hostiles. We've also given you some extra tools. We'd prefer it if you didn't break them. I'll run through their features on our live fire range. Once you're happy, we can move on to the mission itself. Training rifle ahead by the OP. Pick it up and let's begin. Roger that, Control. Take a prone position to stabilize your base. Switch on your binocular display to enable hostile tags. Tag the target straight ahead. You're 12 o'clock. Tagging hostiles will give you their range and keep track of their movements. Your scope also allows you to measure range to targets. Go to glass and see for yourself. The upper left quadrant in your scope is a rangefinder. The target's height on that scale indicates their distance from you. It'll change according to your zoom ratio. Focus on your breathing. Splash this target. Aim for the head. Hit. Go for the next one. Next target, your 12, 300 meters. I know you're used to doing the maths for range, wind speed, and direction in your head. We've saved you some time. Adjust for range and use the bullet drop curve to line the shot up. Check the distance and wind direction. Go for a headshot. Remember, align the wind curve with the distance. Good. 
Raven, find your next target. Adjusting your scope to target's range will improve accuracy. I've marked the distance for you. Set your scope elevation to 400. By calibrating your scope properly, you won't have to manually adjust your aim up or down to compensate for the distance and bullet drop. Good. Splash four more now. There's plenty of ammo. Restock or reload when you need it. I know you're a marksman, but use your binoculars to tag hostiles before taking the shot. It'll give you distance to target to zero your scope. Excellent. First target down. Two more to go. More to go. Your scope is zeroed now. We can move on to the next stage of familiarization. Head to the door behind you. Move through the door to the next area. We have some additional kit to familiarize yourself with. First up, Falcon Drone. Pick it up. Select it from your inventory. Now launch it. The Falcon can see when you can't. There are two enemies behind that metal wall ahead. Locate and tag them with the drone. It has a limited battery life, but will recharge when lost. The drone can hack CCTV boxes. We're looking into possible upgrades later. There's a CCTV access point in the building below. Send the drone in and hack it. That interference is caused by a jamming tower. You're likely to encounter more of them during your missions. They're heavily armored, so don't try to destroy them. Just keep the drone out of their jamming range. Your mask's hood will indicate when you're close to one. Thankfully, their heavy armor does limit signal range. Use the drone to find an alternate route to the CCTV box. Hacking one access point gives you control of all the cameras connected to it. It also prevents them detecting your presence afterwards. Any hostiles you spot on camera will be tagged in your hood too. Matt Andy. You're up to speed on the drone now. There's another piece of kit on the table. Have a look. These auto turrets sync with your hood. You still need to mark hostiles for the turret manually, but it can then fire at your command. Once placed, you set it up via your mask's binocular mode. Focus on the hostiles you tag with the drone. Then you need to mark them for your turret. Remember, Turret marking is separate from your binocular tagging. Exit binocular mode and command the turret to fire. You're done with gear familiarization. One thing I should mention, you can use a turret's inbuilt camera for overwatch, or use it to execute simultaneous shots if needs be. Also, the turrets are under constant development. We may be able to upgrade them later. That's all the new gear covered. We have a spot set up to test special ammo too. Or you can head straight out. There's a truck waiting in the back.
Raven, I'm sure you know. The record for the longest sniper kill belongs to a Canadian Special Forces operator. During the Iraq War, he hit a target over two miles away. Today's mission won't need you to hit anything that far, but it's still going to be a challenge. This operation is designated Cold Bore Zero. We're dropping you onto a plateau located within range of all three targets. Your window of opportunity is small, so hit and move. The first target here is Antoine Zaza, Rashta's favorite warlord and quartermaster. The Zaza clan are arms dealers alongside other criminal enterprises. Eliminate him and the Kuamari government will struggle to equip their militias. Your second target is a disgraced SAS officer, Captain Ronald Payne. He's in charge of the Army's tactical training and currently stationed at one of their boot camps. Your third target is Colonel Fyodor Novikov, a Russian GRU agent sent here to control logistics and supply. Removing these actors from the board will seriously hamper Rashida's plans. Stay sharp. I'll be in contact when you arrive on site. Control, do you read? This is Raven. Roger, Raven. What's your status? I've exited the Hilo, and I'm commencing recon of the plateau. Intel indicates light foot patrols and some forward observation posts only. Proceed with caution, and you should reach the sniper hides with little opposition. Understood. The plateau will provide you with three OPs which overlook each target location. They should give you a good line of sight on any hostiles. Sounds like a piece of cake. Except for the range. And with no spotter. I'm confident you like this. It's one of the reasons we picked you. No pressure then. Let me know when you've reached the first OP. Roger that. Raven out. Control, this is Raven with a SID rep. SID rep. Roger, Raven. Go ahead. I'm heading for the OP overlooking the port. Good. Control, do you read? This is Raven. Roger, Raven. What's your status? I've exited the Hilo, and I'm commencing recon of the plateau. Intel indicates light foot patrols and some forward observation posts only. Proceed with caution, and you should reach the sniper hides with little opposition. Understood. The plateau will provide you with three OPs which overlook each target location. They should give you a good line of sight on any hostiles. Sounds like a piece of cake. Except for the range, and with no spotter. I'm confident you won't miss. That's one of the reasons we picked you. No pressure, then. Let me know when you've reached the first OP. Roger that. Raven out. Control, this is Raven with a sit rep. Roger, Raven. Go ahead. I'm heading for the OP overlooking the port. Good. We just received some fresh intel on Zaza. He may be conducting a deal today. Our sources tracked a known weapons supplier crossing the border earlier and heading on the main road to that location. If we're lucky, you'll catch them both. Do you have anything on the supplier's ETA? Negative. But one of the locals may have more info. 
Look for a hostile stationed near one of the comms relays. I'm sure they've heard the chatter. I probably won't be asking him nicely. How you do it is up to you. Tell on the officer. Looks like that weapon deal is imminent. Then you'd better get set up at the OP. Control, it's Raven. I'm in position above the port. Copy that. Plan your shots carefully. Zaza's likely to run if you miss. So no alarms? Well, not before Zaza is dead at least. Control, I have eyes on the primary target. Confirmed. That's Antoine Zaza. At this distance, it's not gonna be easy. Even with all this fancy new gear. Agreed, but the basics don't change. Get him stationary to improve your odds. I'll line him up somehow. Good luck. Send when ready. Raven, we're trapped. <laughs> Vehicle on approach. Right side. Thanks for the heads up. It's the same make and model we spotted earlier. It's the seller. I'll make sure he doesn't leave. Raven, do you see that front gate? Right side. Sabotage that. You might trap Zaza inside the port. Wait for the seller to arrive first. Understood. The dealer's on site. Focus on Zaza. He'll head to the meeting point. If I can get Zarza into his office, I'll have a clean shot. Any thoughts on that? I see some maintenance men on the roof. Looks like the ventilation system. He must have paperwork he'd want to protect from a small blaze, right? Now I've lost visual on both targets. Maybe there's some way to get the hangar doors open. I'll see what I can do. Target 
target splashed. Zarza's down. Impressive. Not the record, though. Not this time. Besides, this off is off the books. Nothing here you can claim. You might want to also take care of the dealer since he's already arrived. It will earn you a bonus. Zarza is down, so I might not be able to locate the dealer. His car stopped by a big warehouse. Right side. Look for hangar number two. Proceed to the next one. Thank you. 
and search for hostiles location. Out. Control, it's Raven. Do you read me? Loud and clear, Raven. I'm nearly at the OP for the communication facility. So inside one of the buildings. I need to get him out. All that comms equipment will draw a lot of power. Plenty of possible targets. I might do it. Or at least get him to look out of a window. Roger. Good luck. Raven, you need to disable both antennas. We're still picking up data streams from the facility. Novikov can't work without power. Roger. I'll see what I can do. Raven, you can further sabotage Rashida's supply chain if you disable this comms facility. Acknowledged. There are multiple power transformers. Left side, Mark 1-1 one, one, and 1-2, one, and right side, Mark 2-1 and 2-2. Two, two. Do you have visual? Roger, Control. Looks like they're hooked into the satellites. No power, no signal.
weird reading. It looks like voltage fluctuation in one of the antennas. It looks like I disabled the first antenna. Good work. This should get Novikov's attention. Keep an eye out for him. We have an audio signal. Sir, bad news. One of the antennas has completely powered down. Can't you people fix anything? It's been broken so many times that you should be experts at it by now. Control, Raven here. Go for Control. I have eyes on the target. He's outside and on the move. Do you have a good line of sight? Affirmative, but he's moving. I can't get a beat on him for long enough. Can you get him to stay in one spot? Without raising the alarm? Ideally. Let me see what I can figure out. You spook him, and you may not get a second shot. Control out. visual on the primary. Someone close the shutters. They must be powered somewhere. I don't have any blueprints. You'll need to find the source. On it. Wait. Over. your chance. He's heading back inside. Patience, Raven. You'll find an alternative. Control. The second pair of Transformers are still live. Disable them. Novikov will want to inspect any damage. That will be your chance. Then I better not miss.
voltage is unstable. The second antenna is down. Great. Maybe this time you'll manage to get that bastard. We've intercepted their conversation. Another antenna went down. This has to be a big issue. We can't afford to have any issues at this point. Fix it! Is eliminated. One of my better shots. I'll add that to my dope book. Data on previous engagements. Yeah. Useful if I'm shooting under similar conditions again. Data is secure. Job done. Well done. Proceed to the next one. Control, it's Raven. I'm approaching the Overwatch for Payne's training camp. Roger, Raven. Do this quietly. If you alert them, you're going to be knee-deep in hostiles. Payne has sniper training too, so expect the worst. Yep. It's always tricky without a flanker guarding my back. Do it smoothly, and you won't need one.
control. I have eyes on the primary. Do you have a shot? Negative. He's moving too much. I keep losing visual. Hard to hit a moving target at that distance. Yeah, I need to get him in a good open position. Preferably not moving. Any thoughts? Not yet. I'm working on it. Wait. Copy that, Raven. Control. I'm thinking that car lift might be useful. How? Dropping it will get their attention. Maybe even Payne himself. Or it might alert them. Your call. That's Rashida's training program screwed. Confirmed. Good kill, Raven. Always. The sniper is Sector 7. Clear! Roger. Maintain cover and search for hostiles location. Out. Raven. Now that you've disrupted Rashida's command chains, it's time to go after the money. Lars Hallstrom based his operation here in return for immunity from extradition. This freedom allows him to further his own plans and take on any enemies he desires. Governments, financial groups and corporations have all been hit. His money and technical skills keep Rashida's government rich and her people cut off from the rest of the world. They've had no access to foreign media or the internet for a generation. Destroying the main satellite antenna will open access to the west and begin the process of change. 
but the Citadel, his data center, is surrounded by full-spectrum jamming equipment, preventing all unauthorized comms. As long as they're active, we can't see what he's doing, and our audio will be compromised. The servers are cooled by an elaborate liquid immersion system. Take out the pumps, and it will fry the motherboards. Finally, pull any data you can and upload a virus into the mainframe. Eliminate Hellstrom to gain access. Cutting Rashida off from her money is the mission. Don't screw it up. Cool. Oh, this is Raven. Received. Send sit rep. I'm on location. A couple of clicks out from the Citadel. Hellstrom's data center is impressive, but financed with stolen millions and focused on acquiring more. Your last message was unclear. Transmission is poor. It's the satellite jammers. Comms will be weak till you disable all three. First target is ahead. Roger. Stand by. Yeah! They are sure! Control. Radio check. Over. Weak, but readable, Raven. I have eyes on the first jamming tower. Look for a control box near the top of the array. You can disable it from there. Understood. the first jamming tower. Acknowledged. Hostile numbers should be low. But watch out for patrols. Say again. Keep an eye out for patrols. Always do. Raven, I'm looking at SAR data from satellite imaging. There appears to be some kind of tunnel network in that sector. Could be heavily guarded. Or could give you a faster route to the objectives. Roger. We have no intel on the layout. You make the call. Control that. Control. First jammer is down. Good work. One down. Say again.
Control. This is Raven. I read you, Raven. I'm seeing other structures in the forest. Do you have intel? Negative. But they're likely relay stations or signal boosters for the jammers. An elevated position might be handy. I could set up an OP from one. I say again. I may use them to observe patrols. Understood. Your call. Control. Radio check. We can distort it, Raven. Hostile forces are stronger than intel reported. Raven, I have not understood your message. Please say again. I say again, your intel is off. Enemy forces in the area are strong. Raven, say again. You gotta kill these jammers. Another jammer down. Good job, mate. Repeat that, please. Say again, Raven. Still too much interference. Feels good to be out of the desert. Yeah, the weather conditions are on your side this time. That's a first.
I'm on approach to the cooling facility. Rog, Hellstrom servers are chilled from this facility. Take out the pumps and you'll take out the cooling. Thermal issues in data centers are normal, so the system may not flag the problem till it's too late. Pipes will mask the change here. You're smarter than I pegged you for. I have to be. Sniping takes a lot of mental math. Distance, gravity, wind speed. Maybe I'll have you do my taxes. Who pays taxes? Raven out. Do you see that pump control panel? Roger. Access may be underwater. How's your swimming? There's a water pump in the back of the facility. There must be some access in there. I think I found the control panel for the pumps. Confirmed. You'll need to do it manually to make sure. Control. First pump is down. Good work. Two left. Roger that. I'm on it. The water level's dropping. That may open up new access points. Check your surroundings. Alpha Bravo, we have a dead soldier in Alpha 
Raven, some pumps may be accessible through the tanks, but unless you're back in gills, and drain the water before you try those tunnels. Roger. Control. The second pump is disabled. So far, so good. Stay alert, Raven. That's the plan. Stand by. Control. Sit rep. All the pups are down. Raven, acknowledged. Move on to the next objective. The data center may notice a loss of cooling soon. I'm still a distance out from the Citadel. On the move. Good luck. Control out. I've updated the Exfil coordinates on your map. I have a new target for you. Head to the marked location for more information. Lil is somewhere underground.
Control, this is Raven. Can you read me? I read you, Raven. These air ducts are a good option, but the ventilation fans are live. Recon the area. They need power. Perhaps you can overload their controls. Understood. Stand by. Target's blast. Khalil is finished. Good work. Hostile killed. Exfil when you're ready. I've updated your map. Raven, intel from our recon team shows a sniper training camp just outside the Citadel. Hellstrom's obviously a fan of your profession. Good to know. Proceed with caution. Scan all positions. Raven, radio check. Are you receiving? Control. It's weak fare. You're drifting in and out. Our satellite recon shows another jammer located in this sector. Control. Received. The sooner I take it out, the better.
Control. Last jammer's decommissioned. Excellent work. I read you five by five now. At least our comms channel should be clear from here on in. Moving on to the tech whiz. Expo when you're ready. I've updated your map. Job done. On the move. Good work, Raven. Control. I have eyes on the antenna array. Raven, received. Disable it, and let's open this country up to the 21st century. I don't understand why Hellstrom wants to wreck this system. With his skills, I'd just exploit it. Earn a few million. Apparently, you don't share his political philosophy. I don't have a political philosophy. Speaking of which, get a move on. We've got a rebellion to start. Noted. I'm Oscar Mike. I can't wait to see how the people react when Western news starts to spread. Control out. Schematics show three sets of exposed rotating gears around central antenna. You have a brief firing window to cripple each set. So that's three gears I need to hit. Not quite. There are three sets of gears, so you have nine targets. You need to change your firing position after each set. Roger that. Raven out. in quick order. It's a moment. Control. First motor is disabled. Can't hit the other gear motors from here. Acknowledged. Move to second position. Moving. Stand by.
Motor disabled. Nice shoot team. Want to go? Control, I don't have an angle here. I need a better position. Looks like your best spot could be somewhere behind the antenna's relay station at its base. Offline. All targets splashed. Excellent work. Wasn't totally sure I could pull that off. Well, we picked you for a reason. Head to one of the extraction points when you're done here. A new target for you. Head to the mark location for more information.
Intel indicates that the hyena is in the vicinity of the jammers. Copy. Initiating code red. Recon for location. Out. Hyena has been put down. Excellent. Target eliminated. X4 when you're ready. I've updated your map.
Control, come in. This is Raven. Go ahead, Raven. Approaching the Citadel. Any idea why Hellstrom calls it that? From his psych profile, he's obsessed with acquiring knowledge about his enemies. And Citadels usually command a great view of their surroundings. Plus, it matches his twisted sense of humor, given that it's mostly underground. Well, all castles need doors. Time to knock on his, metaphorically speaking. Seems I've killed the power to something down here. The Citadel's defense grid is split into three sectors. You've cut power to Sector 1. The other two must have similar fuse boxes. Try following the cables. Got it. Two more sectors. Follow the cables to shut them down. Raven, their security systems may be accessible at the front gate. You could power them down. It's a high-risk approach, though. If I can't find an alternate route, I may try that. Silent will be safer, for sure. I'll keep that in mind. Raven out. Raven, is there an alternate in full point? Still on recon. Understood.
Patrol, this is Raven. I have eyes on the front gate. Security presence is heavy. Multiple tangos. Then find a back door. We have little in the way of intel on this place. There's a weakness. I'll find it. Stand by. Control, I think I found a way in. An open grate near the bottom of the wall. Report back when you're in the facility. Raj.
code yellow. Detonation in zone eight. Over. Copy that. Look for intruders. Stay in calm. Out. Control, do you copy? Raven, Roger, five by five. I'm at the entrance. It's locked tight. Sweep the area. Look for an alternate access underground. <clears throat> I hope this isn't a bad idea. Sit rep. Roger, Raven. Go for control. I'm inside. Good work. Find Hellstrom. Get his key card. It's the only way to access the mainframe. Control. Do you have eyes on this? Roger. 
That's a lot of computing power. Maelstrom's operation is larger than we thought. I think I see an elevator. Confirmed. That'll take you everywhere you need to go, including the mainframe once you have the access card. I just spotted Hellstrom. He's on B2. That's a poor angle for a shot. But improve your elevation before trying. Yeah. Height will make it easier. A knife up close might be safer, though.
Uniform 1, Uniform 1. We lost the enemy. I repeat, we lost him. Over. Roger. Stay alert.
his key card. Key card acquired. 
Excellent. Now make your way to the mainframe. Use the elevator and go to B4. This is Raven. I have eyes on the mainframe. Control, this is Raven. I've reached the mainframe room. Tread carefully. We'll go. Can you see the access terminal? Not sure. Wait.
Raven, have you located the access terminal? Raj. Time to introduce the virus. Doing it now. Okay, that's not good. Raven, give me a sit rep. The system is down, but I've triggered some kind of alarm. The facility has gone into lockdown. Control, I'm locked in and tangles are flooding the room. I need options. Wait, over. Come on, it's getting hot in here. The security chief, Nakamura, can reset the alarms. Get her key card. How do I find her? Scan the hostiles. She must be out there. Copy that. I'll locate her. Trapped people. He won't go anywhere without my key card. And he won't be getting it <laughs> over my dead body. That's Nakamura. You need her key card to lift the lockdown. Nakamura's keycard. You can bypass their lockdown security now. The lift should be working once you do. Let's see. Rip, all right, it's done. The lockdown has been lifted. Time to exfil. Fast. Perfect. Now the only thing left to do is exfiltrate.
Raven, we need to hurry. The data you pulled from Hellstrom's servers has revealed time-sensitive objectives. We found to here a friendly journalist. They're holding him at a black site in the Sacred Desert. They're interrogating him, but so far he's not broken. Isabella Sanchez is commanding. She learned her trade in the Colombian cartels and is working here as Rashida's personal enforcer. She has orders to kill to here if he tries to escape. And it seems we didn't completely cut off the flow of arms. There's a deal going down between two foreign nationals, Zhivko Dragovich and Hamza Khan. Looks like Dragovich is in country to sell short-range nukes. Khan is the leader of the DLO. We think Rashida will use their terror tactics to soften up the neighbors before the offensive. Whatever they're doing needs to be stopped. Finally, you're tasked to cause some infrastructure damage. Kumar's primary source of energy comes from the Sahil oil fields. Crippling production will slow down heavy industry. This is going to be another Cold Bore Zero operation. Sakri Heights overlook all targets. I'll be in touch when you're on the X. Control, this is Raven. Sending sit rep. Go ahead, Raven. I'm about to click out. Heading for the first OP. Good. Each hide was picked for observation and target acquisition. Your line of sight to the target location should be clear. Roger that. We're dealing with some pretty long ranges here, so take your time and plan each shot carefully. Always do. Careful's my middle name. That's not what it says on your service file. So much for classified. Watch your movement. Intel shows groups of locals who aren't going to be happy to see you. Roger that. Raven out.
Control. Seems you've gone to a lot of trouble for a journalist. He's been a thorn in the government's side for a long time. By exposing that corruption, he's isolated the regime from support and aid. That makes sense. But I don't get why he's still alive. Why bother interrogating him? Just shoot him. Oh. Perhaps they want to find his sources, clear out any moles. Maybe. But I think you're not giving me the full picture here. Control. I'm approaching the village OP. Remember, we need Tahir alive and Sanchez dead. That will be a crippling blow to Rashida's morale. Killing the Enforcer is pretty straightforward. It's Tahir I'm worried about. We managed to get word to him. He's expecting help. Let's hope he acts when he gets it. We know his guard has a set of keys. Drop him and Tahir should react, but do it quietly. They'd rather kill him than let him go. He'll still need to get out of the village. That's why you're on Overwatch. Clear him a path. Remove any obstacles. Copy that. Setting up. I have eyes on Sanchez. I prioritize her before to here. She will execute him if she receives the order, or if she thinks he's escaping. Understood. One shot, one kill it is. Send when ready. Control. Hold. She's going inside. Then persuade her she needs to be outside. Let me work on something. Raven out. Sanchez is dead. One less threat to worry about, but Tahir is still in danger. Understood. I'll deal with the first guard. Deal with the first guard. Once Tahir's out of the cell, he's going to need Overwatch to cover him while he exits the village. We'll go control. The fewer <laughs> obstacles, the easier it will be for him to escape. He doesn't have military training, so let's hope he doesn't panic. I'll do what I can.
Tahir is out of his cell. Maintain Overwatch. I will. Raven, sort out the foot patrol. Things easier for Taj. More tangos. Clear them out. Makes things easier for Taj. Splash those hostiles. To here is grounded till you do. Stay focused.
Decommission those turrets and the guards nearby. Understood. Raven, is that an APC I can see on the feed? Confirmed. It's crew will spot to here for sure. I need to get him to move off. Concentrate. To here is almost there. Code yellow. I repeat, code yellow. Detonation in zone eight. Over. Copy. Investigate the area. Report back. Out. Mission accomplished. Good work today. You can exfil now. Check your map for coordinates. Data is secure. On the move. Well done, Raven. Control, I'm on approach to the Oasis OP. Receive, Raven. Locate both Khan and Dragovich. The exchange is taking place today. We need both eliminated. Maybe I can take them both during the exchange itself. That's your call. If you miss one, the other may escape, though. If you can, take them separately. You may be more successful that way. Well, I do want to improve my odds.
Facial recognition just picked up Dragovich. I can see the tag. He's indoors. I don't have a clean shot. Can you get him outside? I'll think of something. Raven out. I have visual on Khan. Looks like he's taking a walk with a small patrol. They're likely his bodyguards. There have been several attempts on his life since the DLO bombed that U.S. vessel. He never goes out without protection now. So are we doing the U.S. government's dirty work here? There are plenty of administrations that would like to remove Khan and disrupt the DLO. His group will play a crucial role in Rashida's little war. We can't allow that to happen. Understood. I might need to split up his protection detail before I eliminate him. Yeah, the longer you can stay off their radar, the better. Raven, what are those? Looks like some kind of power source. Any loss of power would get their attention. Received. Raven, you should be able to listen in on him now. What's the status? What? That building must be their command center. I see a comms dish on the roof. Blowing the fuse box could draw Dragovich out. Someone's gonna have to fix it. That's true. There goes my cover. Both your primaries are running. I can still do this. Target down. Halfway there. Both HVTs have been splashed. A couple more links in Rashida's chain are broken. I'm RTB, heading for extraction. I've updated the X4 coordinates on your map. 
Roger that. Mobilize. Control. Do you think the DLL will splinter now Khan's dead? We can't but hope. The truth is, they're a pretty hardcore bunch. That Navy bombing they carried out was a mess. Lots of good people died that day. With Khan eliminated, there's sure to be some infighting for leadership. At the very least, it'll keep them busy for a while. Roger that. Raven out. Well done. Proceed to the next one. Control, I'm approaching the OP for the oil field. With Hellstrom out of the picture, this production facility is one of Rashida's few remaining income sources. Bring it down, and her funds will dry up. We'll go. You're going to have multiple infrastructure targets here. Disable enough of them to halt production. What about hostile forces? We're tracking low numbers at the facility. Too few to cause you trouble from their location. But there are plenty of foot patrols on the plateau that could be tasked onto your position. Got it. No alarms. Not unless you want some company up there. They're stockpiling oil. Blowing those barrels would reduce Rashida's supply. And wake up the base. Confirmed. You'll need to prep for company if you do that. Roger. Raven out. Raven, see those red valves on the pipeline? I do. What about them? Breaking them will cause a pressure failure in the lines. Roger. Device disabled. Raven, do you copy? Roger, control. Go for Raven. We're tracking multiple hostiles converging on your position. I appreciate the heads up. This is 
destroyed. All control devices down. Pump disabled. That oil field out of commission has dried up all Rashida's sources of major capital. Kuamar's federal reserves are low too. She's going to struggle to pay for any new armaments, let alone troops' wages. You mean they're not working for love or patriotic zeal? <laughs> Some maybe, but many are conscripts. Desertion is inevitable. It got this one. Good progress. Keep on. Wilco. Disabled. Those barrels are finished. More barrels burning. Zone three or four, approximately. Clear. Next one hit. Our facility is finished. Got to hand it to Rashida. 
We cut off all of her limbs, but she's still wriggling and desperate. She secured the nukes from Dragovich, and, with her conventional forces depleted, she needs those missiles to win any war. The fallout will pollute the region's oil supplies for generations, and the global economy will collapse. We track them to storage facilities in the port of Assam. We need you to plant charges on each missile. Their guidance systems were en route, but the convoy was taken out by rebel forces. It's sitting at the bottom of a ravine. If you can retrieve a command ship, we'll know who she was targeting. We still don't know exactly where Dragovich got those nukes from, but they passed through a train yard close to the port. See if you can recover any evidence from the freight office. And last but not least, we can no longer leave Rashida in power. She's resisting calls for free and fair elections and has rounded up the leaders of that movement. They're somewhere in the presidential palace. Get them out if you can. While you're there, you can pay a visit to Rashida herself. Send my regards. Good luck. Control, I'm on the ground. Starting recon. Move up to the first location, but keep an eye out for patrols. Rashida's forces are weakened, but she's got enough left to end you. Acknowledged. All it takes is one bullet. Which you know better than anyone. Solid copy. You've made it this far. I know you can finish this. Control out. on the crash site. Treat the wreckage. The control chips may be underwater. It's vital we have that data. We must determine the target location. Are we sure the chips are still on site? That's uncertain. But Rashida's forces took control shortly after the crash. There was little time for any cargo to be removed. And you only need to retrieve it. Unlucky for them. But lucky for us. Time for a swim. Sectors. 
Charge from cover. Out. Chip. Excellent. Now exfil before anyone else comes looking. Control. Can't say I was comfortable putting C4 on nukes. As long as they're not armed, they're just big metal tubes. What about the uranium? We have a cleanup crew holding offshore. As soon as you're done with Rashida, they'll retrieve it.
Raven, control here. Satellite tracking shows three locations for the missiles. I'm sending you coordinates now. Raj. You need to plant C4 in all three spots. We can't afford to leave any missiles behind. I'm on it. Stand by. Not this time.
from cover. Out. Kilo 5 to base. We lost him. Awaiting orders. Roger. Search for the hostile. He can't be far. Out. Seems like all doors are locked. Did you find any other info points? Not yet. Stand by. First charge is set. Good. One down. Accidental discharge. I'm taking fire. Leo one four, call to head. Tango three to base. I heard an explosion. Zone three or four, approximately. Clear. That's done it. Access problem solved. Watch your angles and get in there. Dispatch all squads! Flank him! Out! This is Whiskey Free. We lost the enemy. Second charge is placed. Okay, that's two.
All charges set. Time to clear out. I'm at the train yard. Good. Personally, I'd find an OP, scout out patrol routes, and plan your entry point. The freight office should have documents that'll tell us where the missiles were shipped from. I have tangos in the buildings and out in the open. Looks like they're expecting trouble. After all your work, security has been tightened at all critical locations.
recently, I'd find an OP, scout out patrol routes, and plan your entry point. The freight office should have documents that'll tell us where the missiles were shipped from. I have tangos in the buildings and out in the open. Looks like they're expecting trouble. After all your work, security has been tightened at all critical locations.
you, this is Delta 2-1. We have a sniper on us. Search clearance needed. Over. Copy. Take up defensive positions. Locate the shooter. Out. There's an access panel. Then you'll need a key card. You could try the security office, or a guard might have one. Most likely one of the officers. Keycard. 
Get in that office and find that cargo manifest. Cargo manifest. Does it specify materials and origin? Roger. There's clear reference to nuclear materials and the route they traveled. That's the confirmation we needed. Good work. Control. I'm outside the palace walls. I have fresh satellite intel showing multiple hostiles in the grounds and what looks like automated turrets outside. Check your angles and watch high. Wherever Rashida goes, she is heavily guarded. Anything on the prisoners? No. No updates. We last had them somewhere in the dungeons. Free them if you can.
Doorways, windows, and levels. Plenty of places hostiles could be. If you can stay dark, you'll improve your odds. Watch your movement and be methodical.
Mission acquired. Over. beneath the palace. We may lose our visual feed down there. If so, you'll be on your own. That's new. Stand by. When the shooting started, just ran. No oh, shit! What's happening? Bridge collapse. I've fallen into some kind of water tank. Are you still functional? Roger. But it's low light, and I've got no idea where I am. Your mask can scan the terrain, give you some idea of the features at least. They're still alive. I hear the audio. Approach carefully. If they see you, they might kill the prisoners.
Control. We were too late. Those screams were coming from a laptop. Recorded video. Are you sure they're dead? Affirmative. This visual's pretty conclusive. Have you found any bodies? No. But they were on screen. It wasn't an easy death. Okay. Security data on that laptop. We'll assess later. You can't do anything else down there. Look for a way to get back to ground level. Keep heading up. Copy that. I'll find some stairs. Control. Do you have visual? I'm in the upper part of the palace. Roger that. Rashida's quarters are in the presidential tower. Keep heading up and you'll find it. She's usually covered by a security detail. Let's hope so.
each minute of each hour is fixed. This is all. has been triggered. Rashido is in the primary. I have a positive ID. Target's down. Excellent work. Now get out of there. Charlie, copy. Follow up and engage. Out.
Raven, I have a new target for you. Head to the Mark location for more information. I did plenty of tours in the Middle East, but never came here. The Albakas managed to avoid the attention of Western governments. No need for foreign troops. Until now. Well, Rashida has overreached. If she'd stayed within her borders, you wouldn't be making a house. All this is her own government is unsure about having a female president. They've all been in charge for too long. Once Rashida is eliminated, elections are inevitable. Let's hope so. Nelly is no more. Excellent. Target eliminated. X for when you're ready. I've updated your map. Problem solved and a lot of fires put out. Rashida's little war would have impacted more than Kuamar and her near neighbors. This conflict had the potential to burn up the whole region. But she's out of the picture. The command chain is broken and no one is going to use those nukes. Kuamar now has a chance to return to the peaceful state it was before the Albakas seized power. More critically for us, oil supplies are no longer under threat. The global economy won't be crashing anytime soon, and the CEOs of certain multinationals are breathing easier now that Elstrom is dead and his stolen data corrupted. Well, apart from the files you've seized, which our tech teams are decrypting. We will make sure that the government here won't block an election. There's a good chance it'll be free and fair, too. In fact, our man, to here, is leading the pool of candidates. It'll be useful to have someone on the inside. You must have wondered why we helped a journalist, right? Now that your work here is done, and all payments made, why don't you have a break? Heal, rest, recharge, but stay in touch. You will be hearing from us again.
seems we were wrong about to hear. His actions since taking over the presidency have been troubling. We recruited him two years ago due to his connections with Kuamar and his articles critical of the Albaca family. There were no plans to replace Rashida back then, just keep a weather eye on her activities. All that changed onto Hia's last trip. He told us about the attack before they picked him up, and we needed to act. You got the job. The election afterwards was just good fortune. Or so we thought. Looks like our friends in the East got to him. Now he's working for them. With Tahir running things, our whole game plan in Kuamar will be blown. We intercepted a transmission indicating Tahir and his handler have a meeting scheduled. The handler's identity is unknown, but he's in a village close to the airport. We do know he's a heavy smoker, and smoking kills. After eliminating the handler, make sure Tahir gets the same treatment. It'll be a powerful message to the other side. Plus, we'd rather have a neutral running Kuamar instead of one of theirs. We need your long shot skills, as we can't get close to the target sites. Speak to you on the ground. Raven, control here. Send sit rep. Control, I'm on the X. Clear path to the high ground. Remember that eliminating this contact is as important as killing to here. This guy's still at the village ahead. Confirmed. We've monitored calls between them and know that the contact smokes heavily. No other ID available. Their meeting is scheduled for tonight at the airport. Tahir is en route to that location now. This is our best chance to terminate each man without alerting the other. That ridge has solid foot access to OPs for both sides. Roger all. I'm Oscar Mike. Some kind of tower ahead. That could be a good OP. Solid elevation over your terrain. Control, I have Overwatch. The village is below me. Raven, we want this to be precise. We're sending a message to the other side. So make sure you confirm ID before terminating. He has a bad nicotine habit. Tahir doesn't like it. Always complaining about the smell. There are three civilian advisors there. It has to be one of them. Acknowledged. Don't miss. Alert him, and he's sure to run. Control out. <laughs> I have eyes on a civilian. What about the others? There's one. Not enough for confirmation yet. We can provide audio here. Bingo. We have a smoker. You have the green light. Send when ready.
That is a confirmed kill. Enemy agent is down. You can exfiltrate now. Check your map. Roger that. Alerting nearby sectors. Search from cover. Out. Control, I'm on the OP. I can see the lights of the airport. Roger, we're tracking a vehicle approaching from the service road. Left side. Could be to here. Any special orders? Negative, but you may only get one shot at him. There's a lot of cover there, and plenty of escape routes. So take your time, but try to hit him before he boards the transport plane. Acknowledged all. Let's do this. Raven out. I have eyes on to here. Exiting the vehicle. Positive confirmation. That's him. Don't rush this. If you miss or spook him, he'll run. Raven, we're piggybacking to here's call. Patching you in now. He's what? Dead? How? Never mind, hold on. You there? I need to leave soon. Hurry up loading the cargo. I'll call you back when I'm in the air. Confirmed, Raven. Well done. You have hostiles closing in on your- All targets eliminated. You've taken down to here and removed our friend in the village. There are no more- Move! Move! You all know what to do! Yes, sir! Flank him! at peace and free from all external forces sadly even ours but we can live with that for now i'm sure they'll elect another president but they'll need a strong heart given what's happened to the last three 
and you can take heart yourself. You stopped a war, removed a lot of very unlikable people from the planet, and, not least, saved millions from seeing a nuke go off first hand. UN aid organizations are mobilizing. Kumar's population will have the food and resources they need during transition. Oh, and uh, one last thing. We've worked well together. You've proven to be a capable operator. And I've been proud to have you in my old unit. And I don't say that to many. It's Alex, by the way. My name is Alex. I'll send you the number of a burner phone, just in case. One day I might even buy you a pint. Good luck. Control out. <laughs>